Hello everyone. Nowadays, architect drawing has always been a challenge to us. But what are the methods that has been practiced throughout these years? Let me introduce you to post tension. Post tensioning is a method of reinforcing concrete or any other materials which uh, have a high strength uh, steel strands or bars, which also which also known as tendons. A uh, post tensioning application involves uh, structures such as water tanks, bridges, and also parking structure. In many cases, uh, post tensioning allows the construction that would otherwise be impossible to be constructed due to site restraint or um, architecture uh, requirements. So now, let's take a look of what exactly is post tensioning structure or post tensioning beam to be exact. Let's go. steps are taken in the making of post tension beam. First of all, the carpenter should install the soffit homework and then second installation of bottom reinforcement bar will be carried out and then third, the installation of slab cables, fixing rotting hose and bursting links and live stressing anchorage will be taken. Concreting and weighting concrete to achieve transfer cube strength then the stressing of cable upon achieving the transfer concrete cube strength will be taken and then after the approval from the engineer the grouting of cables will be proceed I have a video for you let's go There are three advantages for post tension beam, which is firstly, uh, it reduces the shrinkage cracking. Secondly, uh, cracking that do form are held tightly together. And thirdly, is, uh, it lets us design longer span in uh, elevated member. These are some of the infos on post tension beam. If you like it, please give us a, a thumbs up down below. Bye.